The fundamental importance of proper research data management is that it's the cornerstone for evidence-based research. Uh, following a standardized way of uh, managing data ensures that our data is of good quality, it's shareable, and it's reusable by intended uh, policy and development uh, practitioners. It's essential for researchers to stick to the research data life cycle as, in, as it ensures that our data and our methods are suitable for its intended use. The research data management life cycle is generally the flow of data throughout its lifespan. It generally consists of five steps, which include data collection, data cleaning, data analysis, data documentation, and data publishing. The first step is data collection. Here we work on the development of a data collection protocol, which explains the methods, what data will be created, and how. The second step is data cleaning. This involves the process of checking, validating, and cleaning data. Step number three is data analysis. Here, we deploy appropriate techniques to unravel the relations, patterns, and principles contained in the data. Uh, step number four is data documentation. This provides the metadata that allows us to understand the format, content, and context of the data. MEL is aligned with the CGCOM metadata standard that allows discoverability of our datasets. The last and final step is data publishing. And within MEL, we have an outputs reporting module, where once an output has been completed and has gone through the appropriate checks, it's directly deposited into the data repository. Through MEL, uh, we have proper planning, and this is through the data management plan, where you're able to list all the deliverables you are planning to collect within the project life cycle, and you're able to monitor as we go on. And on top of that, we have strict uh, data standards that you have to adhere to so that you are compliant. Through MEL, our researchers are able to develop a framework and resources to support their data. Uh, this enables us to identify weaknesses throughout the research life cycle and we're able to uh, rectify them in due time before the project ends. Uh, MEL also has inbuilt repository systems which enables us at the end of the project to ensure that our data is archived properly and shared to the intended audiences.